short answer questions. 1 into 2, 2 marks. First question. Prove that prove that the roots of x minus a into x minus b is equal to h square are always real. Okay. So, now in order to prove that the roots of this equation are always real means the first step we have to find out discriminant of this equation. If the discriminant of equation is actually greater than or equal to 0, then we say that roots are real. So, first given here x minus a into x minus b equal to h square. First write a quadratic equation x square minus b x minus a x plus a b is equal to h square. This can be written as x square minus of a plus b into x plus a b minus h square is equal to 0. Comparing with comparing with a x square plus b x plus c is equal to 0. Here a is equal to 1, b is equal to minus of a plus b and c is equal to a b minus h square. Now, let us verify it is a discriminant d d is b square minus 4 a c. Let us substitute b for minus of a plus b. So, minus of a plus b whole square and minus 4 into 1 into a b minus h square. This is a plus b whole square because minus square is plus only minus 4 a b plus 4 h square. Now, we have one formula a plus b whole square minus 4 a b is a minus b whole square plus this 4 h also 4 h square also we can write 2 h whole square. This is a perfect square plus this perfect square. Perfect square is always positive perfect square is always positive. So, that means here a minus b whole square is greater than or equal to 0, even 2 h whole square is also greater than or equal to 0, greater than 0, greater than 0, positive. So, that means it is greater than 0. Since d greater than 0, therefore, roots are real problem. So, let us move to the next problem. Second problem, form a quadratic equation quadratic equation whose roots are seven plus r minus 
टू रूट फाइव सो दैट मीन्स टू रूट ऑफ ए क्वाड्राटिक इक्वेशन आर गिवेन वन इज सेवन प्लस टू रूट फाइव अदर इज सेवन माइनस टू रूट फाइव we have to frame a quadratic equation so that means here alpha is given beta is given the quadratic equation whose roots are alpha beta is x square minus of alpha plus beta into x plus alpha beta is equal to 0 that means first we have to find out alpha plus beta and alpha beta then apply the formula so write down like this let alpha is equal to 7 plus 2 root 5 beta is equal to 7 minus 2 root 5 alpha plus beta 7 plus 2 root 5 plus 7 minus 2 root 5 both cancel here 14 alpha beta that means 7 plus 2 root 5 Into seven minus two root five. So how to find out this product? This is in the form of a plus b into a minus b. So a square minus b square, seven square minus two root five square. Forty nine, seven square, seven into seven. This is four into root five is square is five. Forty nine minus twenty. So nine twenty nine alpha beta. Now we know alpha plus beta and alpha beta. So that means now the quadratic equation, the quadratic equation whose roots are whose roots are. alpha beta is x square minus of alpha plus beta x plus alpha beta is equal to 0 now alpha plus beta 14 alpha beta is 29 so therefore x square minus 14x plus 29 is equal to 0 this is a required equation next let us move to the next problem form the third one form form a quadratic equation quadratic equation whose roots are Whose roots are minus three plus r minus five i? Okay, let us solve this problem. Solution. Let us say alpha is equal to minus three plus five i. Okay. beta is equal to minus 3 minus 5i now alpha plus beta minus 3 plus 5i minus 3 minus 5i this cancel minus 6 now let us find out alpha beta Minus three plus five i into minus three minus five i a plus b into a minus b. So minus three square minus five i square nine minus twenty five i square. What is i square? Minus one. So since i square is equal to minus one. This becomes nine plus twenty-five, which is thirty-four. Now formula: the quadratic equation, quadratic equation with roots 
alpha beta is x square minus of alpha plus beta into x plus alpha beta is equal to 0. Let us substitute alpha plus beta is equal to minus 6, alpha beta is equal to 34 x square minus of minus 6 x plus 34 is equal to 0. Therefore, x square plus 6 x plus 34 is equal to 0.